Hey everyone, this is how my day looks like as a software engineer in Mongolia. I woke up at 8.30. For most people, it's late, but I walked late last night. I mean, every night I walk. I'm developing my social accounts, posting contents every day and night. Anyways, it's morning. I drink water first. Also, the water I prepared yesterday. Touch your lips, look at the ceiling and one shot. Bruh. It also applies to water. Silly me. Then I go into the toilet and start shaving. If you are a young boy without a beard, I wouldn't recommend you shave your yellow hair. It's very annoying. Now I must shave twice a week. After washing my face, I do my workout. 150 jumping jacks, 150 sit-ups, and finally I do at least 100 push-ups, divided into 4 to 5 reps in 30 minutes. For breakfast, I eat 2 or 3 eggs with the bread in the morning. I'm currently learning freelancing from Andrew Tate's platform named The Real World. Maybe I will cover it in another video. In Ulaanbaatar, you need a bus or a car, or you'll get sick in minus 30 Celsius. But I don't care, I walk 20 to 30 minutes to my office. Continues on effect. Cost low money. Compound 10 seconds. To use the time efficiently, I listen to audiobooks. It's been three years since I started listening to audiobooks. If you want to know more about audiobook experiences, let me know in the comment section. Well, 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 we have arrived at my office. I'm currently working at Ant Global. And man, I love this company so much. You'll be surprised how I work here. Morning, Mr. CJ. I'll be greeting everyone I see and open my laptop straight into the walk. Oh yeah, I almost forgot, they provide breakfast on the Monday and Wednesday. Today is a special day, Wednesday. I'll be happy to eat my eggs. At around 10.20, I go into the focus. Remember, if you could do the tasks fast, team will have more time on discussing on the result. And around 12 o'clock, we go out and eat lunch together with the team. I like this restaurant, it provides bread and special food depending on the weekdays. Today we got a salad, soup, cake and hoshu. After we enjoy our food, we have 30 minutes before the lunchtime finishes. We can play tennis, football or my favorite one is chess. I have an interesting story for this. There was a table in the middle of the office, no one wants to sit on it because people were going around all day, so I set up a chess board. Now everybody, everybody loves it. It's beautiful, isn't it? In the movies, programmers like hacking people in the night in a cage. In the reality, it's so different. Programmers work at the daytime and code a little bit and think like, why it's not working? Code again and think like, why it's working now? Is there something wrong? Did I miss something? Or at least it's working, let's push it and go on to the next task. After all my tasks have finished, I'll be taking a nap for 20 or 30 minutes. Working in a full-time job takes all the day life away, but I got used to it. I'm currently reading this book named Power. This book is all about how to write better, covered every little detail Steve Jobs have applied to his speech. Give a look. Consider following Hibby as a developer. May innovative ideas and creative solutions bear fruit in that space. Now I'm reading the purposes of the landing page. Right now you might be thinking like, hey bro, you are not even working. But there are days you work all day and days you finish all the tasks given and being free. With the free time, I'll be writing my diary. A diary helps me a lot. I've been writing down what I achieved for 3 years now. In the meeting, we have summarized the work and planned tasks for the next week. And finally, I'm here playing chess with my colleagues before leaving work. I love chess so much. Maybe that's why I'm the winner of the chess tournament at my office. Let me know in the comment section if you want to watch my live stream again. We have a flexible time at job, 8 to 5, 9 to 6 and 10 to 7. I always go out at 7 pm. And I eat my dinner out. If there's people watching from Mongolia, it's a low budget restaurant serving thousands of people but I like some of the food. I don't cook myself because there's lots of work to do when I'm home. Ulan Bator to Utah. All the entire town. world. I quit video games six months ago, now I'm putting all of the time into freelancing instead. 
prospecting clients on Twitter, harnessing Instagram, sometimes I edit videos, sometimes I code, with all the work I put in, my goal is to build a house for my mother. It's now midnight and I'm in a call with my mentor and we'll be talking until like 1am. And I will call it a day, so everybody watched until this point, thank you so much for watching, make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss upcoming videos.